tango. The dance of love becomes the dance of health. Researchers at La Trobe and Melbourne Universities are testing a treatment for Parkinson's disease that includes tango dancing. Another group of Australian academics has shown that tango dancing has significant health benefits for people experiencing mood disorders. Researchers have found that the close embrace danced in tango leads to a sense of connection with one's partner and it's this sense of connection that helps people to feel more in the present and stops them thinking about their feelings of distress. It was this element of tango that inspired the show Milonga. In tango I saw some sort of magic happening, some sort of uh, communication going on that was completely without any sign of even almost visual contact or, or words. Nelida Rodriguez de Azur has taught Sharon Stone and Robert Duval to dance. She too believes in the restorative power of tango. The most important thing in tango is the feeling. You, you have a man, you have a woman, and that embrace is, for me, woo, it's beautiful. It's something special, and of course, always an emotion. A lot of emotion. It's far from the one-dimensional view of tango experienced by tourists in Buenos Aires. Dancing is not a matter of just looking faces or connecting bodies. It's just something else there. The proper atmosphere created just for two people connect, being connected. The comforting touch of close embrace, seen as part of tango's erotic passion, may actually be the key to depression, anxiety, stress and possibly even Parkinson's. Emma Hannigan, SBS World News.